but expert Angela Levin, speaking to The Sun about the prince, said that he can't have it both ways as HES on a one-way road away from the monarchy. This comes after the Queen paid tribute to both Prince Charles and Prince William during her pre-recorded COP26 address. She neglected to mention the Duke of Sussex, despite the fact that he himself has also undertaken environmental campaigning work. Ms. Levin, a royal biographer who spent a year accompanying Harry on his royal duties, said, I imagine he could well feel snubbed. I think HES very sensitive now about his family, and I think HES between a rock and a hard place, but HES on a one-way road. He was very close to his father and his brother, but is so rude about them now, and he may well feel that HES missing out. H has missed out on this climate change discussion, which HES trying to work for as well. But you can't have it both ways. You can't be independent but part of it. I don't believe HES grasped that. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex announced they would be stepping back from royal duties in January last year and moved to LA the following March. The couple has been vocal about climate change, urging fans to do their part in protecting the planet through their joint Instagram account. However, they have also drawn criticism for alleged hypocrisy after using a private jet to leave a concert urging action on climate change and extreme poverty. The pair attended Global Citizen Live, a 24-hour concert that called on the U.S. to halve its emissions by 2030 and on the wealthiest nations to meet a £70 billion a year promise to help developing countries go green. In her speech to delegates at the Climate Summit, the Queen said, It is a source of great pride to me that the leading role my husband played in encouraging people to protect our fragile planet, lives on through the work of our eldest son Charles and his eldest son William. I could not be more pr Indeed, I have drawn great comfort and inspiration from the relentless enthusiasm of people of all ages, especially the young, in calling for everyone to play their part. But Ms. Levin noted that very few royals were mentioned in the speech, something which the biographer put down to the Queen's succinct approach to public messaging. She said, the Queen is succinct, articulate and says things from the heart. I couldn't see why Harry would be mentioned. He isnt a member of the royal family now. H is doing his own thing. I wouldn't think he should be included, HES stepped down from being a working royal. What he does is for himself and Meghan, he doesn't deserve to be mentioned. The Queen's speech was pre-recorded at Windsor Castle, following her decision not to attend the climate summit as a result of health issues.